And now we're going to turn to an Amber Alert for a missing Stanislaw County boy. And that Amber Alert has been downgraded tonight. Four-year-old Giuliani Cardenas was taken from his grandmother's arms on Tuesday. Investigators also suspended the search of a canal in Patterson for two days. The canal is where a witness reported seeing the suspect's vehicle last. Here's a look at that suspect. This is Jose Esteban Rodriguez. He is the ex-boyfriend of the missing boy's mother. Other. Cron 4's Da Lin talked with Giuliani's family tonight who are hopeful for his safe return. Okay, Kate, uh, we're standing in front of Giuliani's home, and you can see in the garage and in the driveway, there are a lot of candles hoping for his safe return. The Sheriff's Department has reduced the Amber Alert from statewide to regional. Right now, the Amber Alert is only active in San Jose and the area between Stockton and Fresno. That's because uh, Jose Rodriguez, the suspect, has family ties in those two areas. Now, the other development tonight is that the Sheriff's Department has postponed the canal search for 48 hours and the missing boy's family is saying that uh, that is a very encouraging sign. They think four-year-old Giuliani Cardenas is still alive and not in that canal. I talked to Giuliani's mother earlier and she is still very hopeful that investigators will bring her son back to her. I think that's good because um, I've been saying from the beginning that they're not going to find his car in there. I mean, they're, they find a lot of cars, but not Jose's car because he didn't drive his car in there. <laughs> You can see in that interview, the mother was able to uh, smile a little bit because she was so relieved that they didn't find her son in that canal. Uh, the neighbors around here have been very supportive of the family. One of Giuliani's friends, a nine-year-old girl, put up yellow and blue ribbons on all of the trees on the street uh, this morning. She says blue is Giuliani's favorite color and yellow stands for hope, hoping he'll be found alive. Let's come back here alive now. Again, you're looking at the candles in front of Giuliani's uh, drawing. Way. They're hoping that they'll find him alive. Now, before the sheriff's department actually uh, suspend that uh, canal search, they did spend a good part of the day looking for that silver Toyota Corolla. And Cronforce Reggie Kumar has more on that part of the story. Stanislaus County investigators spent most of Saturday using sonar technology to search the Delta Mendota Canal for a 2003 silver Toyota Corolla. That's the car investigators believe Jose Rodriguez was driving when he reportedly abducted four-year-old Giuliani Cardenas from his grandmother's home in Patterson on Tuesday. While searching the water, they discovered the stolen red Nissan truck and pulled it from the canal. Since Wednesday, investigators have recovered five stolen vehicles and none of them match the car the suspected kidnapper was driving. Sheriff Adam Christensen says they finally finished searching three large tunnels described as a self-cleaning siphon deep under the water. We were able to get into all three of the blocks in the self-cleaning siphon searching from north to south. So we were actually able to send the, uh, the, the, the technology, the rover for lack of a better term, uh, through all three blocks here onto the south side, and they are clear. There are no vehicles in those blocks. Investigators say they still believe the farm worker's story about seeing a car matching the suspect's Toyota Corolla drive into the canal with an adult and child inside. This is our best credible lead. Uh, it's our and, and we believe that the witness truly saw what he shared with us. There isn't any reason to disbelieve him. Um, he appears very trustworthy. Uh, he's a humble man who obviously was frightened by what he saw. And investigators say Rodriguez hasn't used his cell phone or debit card since the abduction. He's not making purchases with a debit card that he was normally using pre-abduction. We hold out hope that we're going to find Giuliani alive. I mean, again, that has always been our goal. Investigators have wrapped up their search of the canal for now. They plan to get some much needed rest and will resume searching south of the canal, which is this direction, in about 48 hours. In Patterson, Reggie Kumar, Cron 4 News.